Hi everyone, Ravi this side. Welcome to Engineering Adda. So today in this video, we are going to discuss about the fuzzy query. How to implement the fuzzy query in Elasticsearch using Kiwana dashboard we are going to discuss today. If you are new to the Elasticsearch stack, then there is a video on my channel where I have discussed how to install the Elasticsearch and Kibana using Docker on the Windows machine. And after that, I have also covered about the basic CRUD operations in Elasticsearch and match, match all query and the field query. So basic aspect of the Elasticsearch I have already covered. So if you are new to the Elasticsearch, just go and watch those video. And in this video, we are going to discuss about the fuzzy query. Okay, so let's get started. So before going to uh, implement the fuzzy query, I just want to let you know what is fuzzy query or what is fuzziness or what is fuzzy search. So let me try to go to the browser and here you can see, uh, let me try to open this. Let me try to open the Google. And let's say you have opened the Google uh, home page where you can search something. So let's say I just search for the laptop, okay? And here you can see, uh, let me try to do it again. So here you can, you can see in auto suggest you are getting the so many options related to laptop. But what if I say you miss the letter T? Still you are getting the result related to the laptop itself, right? Most of the results are related to laptop. So this is about the fuzzy query. That means when you are going to search some text and you missed some letter inside that text or you have uh, like replaced the particular letter inside the text with the, some other letter still you are getting the same result that means the search engine is giving you the fuzzy result that means the fuzziness is allowed in the search engines that means you can uh, miss out some particular letter inside the word or the text that you are going to search or you can replace some particular letter or the word particular letter inside the word that you are going to search okay so this is about the fuzzy query or fuzzy search now how we can implement the fuzzy query in the elastic search let me try to tell you so before going there uh, i would just want to show you that i already have installed the elastic search and kibana in the docker and both of them are up and running so you can see the port number for elastic search is 9200 and for the kibana it is 5601 so let me try to go to the browser and here you go i already have access the elastic search on the port number 9200 and you can uh, see this result and coming to the kibana you can see uh, we are accessing kibana on the port number 5601 and now if you'll come here to the left top left you will find this uh, option you just have to just click here and then if you'll go to the management you will find this dev tool just open this dev tool here you can see there is a two part of the dev tool one is where you can write the query and second where you will get the result in the right side okay so I already have uh, covered about how to create an index and how to perform the CRUD operations in the elastic search as well as I also have covered about the match all match so everything I have covered in this video I'm just going to tell you about the fuzzy query okay so how to uh, write the fuzzy query for the elastic search so let me try to do that so let's say uh, first of all let me try to do a normal search to show you the result what I have okay so let's say it is get an index that I have created is product and inside the product index I have inserted couple of document which is related to the product itself so let me try to show you those things okay and then we'll apply the apply the query uh, fuzzy query in this index okay so let me try to run this and here we go you can see we are getting the hits and inside the hits you can see this is the document ID and the type is document and you can see in the source you will get the result so we have inserted the document which is related to the product 
and in each document we have the attributes called product ID name quantity and the price so in the document uh, PW hyphen something you can see we have inserted the product ID one name is mobile quantity is one and price is to 20,000 similarly for the document ID one the same result is there and for the document ID two we have the laptop for document ID three we have the tablet so this many records or this many document which is related to the products I have inserted in the index called product okay now I just want to apply the fuzzy query okay so uh, before going to apply the fuzzy query let me try to show you how the match query is behaving okay so so here you can see I already have written the match query you can see we are uh, searching out inside the index called product and the query is match and on which field you want to search okay so you can see we have provided the name and in the query we are providing the value of that particular name so here you can see in the right side we have the product ID name quantity and the price which is related to the product itself right in the name we have the laptop we have tablet we have mobile so based upon the name we are just going to run a match query okay so this is how the match query is looking like you have to write the query and the query type is match and then you have to provide the field on which you want to search and in the query you have to provide the field name okay or field value you can say so we want to uh, search the laptop okay so let me try to run this query and let's say what is the result so you can see we are getting the laptop but what if I told you that you just miss uh, the T in laptop okay and let me try to do a search here you are getting nothing right but when you will apply the fuzzy query this lap op will also lead to the result of laptop okay so let me try to do that or before going to uh, write the fuzzy query you can also directly go to the elastic search website there they have described about the fuzzy query and its a uh, syntax and its query itself so let me try to go there and try to show you the documentation of the elastic search for the fuzzy query okay so elastic search fuzzy search you can see and let me try to go there so here you can see the fuzzy query returns the document that contains terms similar to the search terms as measured by the Levenstein edit distance so what is Levenstein distance? You can go and uh, read about it. Now let me try to uh, come down, and here you can see an edit distance is the number of one character change needed to turn one term into another. These changes can include. So the edit uh, distance is one character change, right? So if you see here, changing a character like box become fox is still. If the box exists in your document, then when you are just going to search for the fox, it will also give you a result for the box as well. Similarly, here you can see removing a character, uh, black become black, inserting a character, sick become sick, and transposing two adjacent character like act become cat. So this will, uh, this is the fuzzy search or fuzziness, okay? And this result is still like if you are searching for the um, let's say you are searching for act and you just uh, provided the text as cat if the act is existing in your document it will try to find out the act okay so this is what it means so now let me try to go down and here we are uh, this is the query for the fuzzy search so how you can uh, write the query you can see you are doing the search and then in the query this is a fuzzy and you have to provide the field name and then its value okay so let me try to go to the kibana and let me try to write the query for you so let's say get and the index is product where we want to do a search so search and then we need to provide the query details so query okay and in the query we just want to do a fuzzy search and then we need to provide the field and then its value so let's say the field we want to apply is name we want to do a fuzzy search in the field name so by name we are just going to do a search 
okay now here we need to provide the value so let's say value and and let's say we want to search for the laptop so let me try to provide the laptop here so this time we are providing the correct name and let me try to do the search and here you can see we are getting the result for the laptop now what I will say just remove the word or the letter T from the word laptop and do a search again still we are getting the result for the laptop right that means the fuzzy search or fuzzy query is working fine now what I would say uh, let's say replace the uh, character T with the K okay and then do a search still we are getting the result here you can see I'm running it and we are getting the result so that means the fuzzy search is working fine so there is another uh, index that is fuzziness let me try to go to the uh, documentation and try to show you what is fuzziness is so here you can see uh, in the query this is the second query for the fuzzy query and here you can see we can apply the fuzziness in the query itself so what is fuzziness you can see uh, here is the definition for the fuzziness it is optional string maximum edit distance allowed for matching okay so how many terms or how many character you want to uh, miss or uh, like reverse or you want to replace with some other characters so how many of them you want to do that is the fuzziness measure that is the fuzziness index you can say so let's say the fuzziness level is one that means you can up to one character you can either replace or uh, remove or add some other thing at the place of that one character if the fuzziness level is two that means up to two character you can do the fuzzy search so now let me try to go to the kibana again and try to do or like try to apply the fuzziness here so after value you can do the fuzziness and let's say this time the fuzziness is if the fuzziness is auto that means it is doing the fuzzy search for at least one character okay so let me try to do uh, the fuzziness to two that means up to two character we can miss or we can replace with the other character so let's say this time uh, one character i already have replaced with the k and at the place of o just want to provide a that means we are doing the fuzziness of two characters now let me try to do a search here and still we are getting the result you can see so this is about the fuzziness so this is all about the fuzzy query how to uh, write the fuzzy query and how to apply the fuzziness in the elastic search so this is about the video guys if you like the video please hit the like button and please subscribe the channel for more such content thanks